What's up guys, girls, and fans of the water cycle? So I don't know if you know this, but I'm actually really good at making levels. Unfortunately, not all of my levels are good as my smash hit just hexagon force that you're seeing me play now. So what I've decided that we're gonna do here is we're gonna go through some of my older levels that aren't as good, and uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try and fix them. Cause yeah, some of my older levels are not very good. I think it's dark blue. So yeah, I've got a couple of levels here that I've previously made that I think could use some improvement in a couple of places. These are all pretty old levels. I think the newest of them was made in like 2019. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna, first we're gonna start with Thunder Zone. Thunder Zone is like a demon level that I made. Oh God, I think I started it in 1.9 and I finished it in 2.0 because I used <laughs> this thing, this like um, teleport glitch that you could use in 1.9 before the teleport portal existed. And honest to god, I honestly, I, I still like this level a lot. I still think it's a decent level. Um, it's honestly probably still one of the best things that I've ever decorated. Uh, but the gameplay is problematic in some places. Like, I like this part. This part's pretty good. And this ship part's a little, eh, a little strange. The next part, however... Oh, now this part, however... I'm sure you could see the problem, but wait. It gets worse. See, you might think that one of these stupid ball parts is bad enough, but did you know that there's another one? Not to mention at the end of the level, there's like a random nine circles part that lasts like two seconds for no reason. Like, like what is the point of this? Why did I make this? Why? Why did I do this? <laughs> so yeah, so what I want to try and do is I want to try and make this part even a little bit better. Um, so I think what we have to do first is, um, I think we have to find the parts. Okay, so let's see, we can use the, the hitbox hack to see which blocks actually, like, have something. And what I think we're gonna do is move them to a different layer. So let me select these all real quick. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so we got all of these. Let's move these to a separate layer. And I think what we're gonna do, add them to a group. What we're gonna do, okay, so what I'm gonna have us do, just gonna paste in a bunch of these and we're just gonna align X them, I think. So now if we do this, these should be evenly spaced. I think there's one too many. <laughs> okay, let's see if that improves readability now. I feel like it will. I don't really see a universe where it doesn't. Oh yeah, that's way better. Okay, all right, cool, cool. Now for the second part. The second part it actually is not as bad because I don't know if you can tell, but the fake blocks actually have this sort of fade out that happens. Like, the, the the fake ones, their outlines fade out every so often for a little bit. But it's so short that it's, like, it's, like, impossible to, to actually read. Yeah, like, it's, like, impossible to, like, read that in enough time. So, let's change that as well. What if when the blocks fade out, like, the outlines fade out, we make the real blocks also fade out? I don't know, I feel like that'll be good. All right, so what I did is I, I did do the fading thing, but I also um, gave them some uh, neat little pulses. So, oh, if I can get through this part, I'll call it a win. Huge. This level's, this, this part's pretty bad too, but I don't really know how to fix this part. All right, here we are. Oh my God, what was I thinking? All right, so we're gonna fix that. This is gonna be the last part we fix. All right, so this is what I came up with. It's marginally easier and I think it looks better. I'm, I'm not, I'm not really sure how to like hide the part where you go through the wall. Um, but it definitely looks better than the nine circles part. So I'm pretty happy with it, I guess. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna move on to Blast Circles, which is a level that I think is pretty good. It's a, it's a, it's, it's, 
the issue is the beginning of it, right? Because the first thing you have to do in the level is this really weird, buggy, late timing. I don't know, man. We're also gonna change the color because blue is awesome and goaded. So we're gonna get rid of this because I don't think that anyone cares how long the level is. Um, I'm not gonna complain too much about the decoration because I just suck at decorating. We're here to fix up the gameplay. The only reason I, I, I changed the nine circles in the last level is because that is like directly affecting the gameplay. Yeah, see like there's no reason why the portal couldn't just be up here. Uh, okay, this should definitely be visible. In fact, why do we even have it? What? There's coins in this level, right? There are. Okay, and this coin is... These coins suck. We're just gonna get rid of the coins, honestly. There we go. Already much better. Move this over and down. Alright, what do we... What do we got now? I, I don't even know why it does that. Oh, is it so you can jump again? That's silly. Just put a J block. Yeah, and this part too. I don't even know what this part is supposed to be. But we're just gonna totally get rid of that. Instead, let's replace it with like... Yeah, something like this that doesn't suck as much. Alright! Pretty good! We have substantially improved the beginning of this level. All right, not bad. Yeah, I mean, honestly, it was really short, but that was really the only part in the level that I wanted to fix. I mean, the rest of the level was pretty fine already, so. Machina version two. This is a level that I, I, I made a long time ago, and it was the first level that I thought that I made that was actually pretty decent. Also, I'm just gonna say this right now. Don't comment that it's Ode's Machina. No, you're just wrong. It is pronounced Machina. 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 Stop commenting that I'm pronouncing it wrong because that's literally how you say it But yeah, I mean I thought this level was decent if there was ever a level that I made that I thought I had a chance of ever getting rated It probably was this one the beginning isn't too crazy But I thought that the later parts look pretty good mainly because I abuse rainbows in this level <clears throat> This was the drop Oh hey more rainbows Oh, hey, more rainbows. All right, yep, yeah, and then uh, and then it ends. So it's not the worst thing that I've ever done. Oh, there's then there's a big smiley face. One thing that I've always disliked, though, I, I, you just put every single letter block down here. Yeah, just cover all of our grounds, all of our bases, you know, you never know what might happen. Yeah, so we're gonna actually just delete all these because honestly, I really do think this is a good level, but I've always, I never in my life understood why I made it so you can't just hold out of that. Something I want to fix at the very start, honestly it's just miscellaneous things. So at the very start, um, I want to fix this because that is a refresh rate bug. Or let's shorten it by a little bit, like a half block. This part in the UFO was always a bit contentious with me. See now it works. <laughs> it's only because there are hidden guide blocks. There we go. Oh, they are on zero. Yeah, these. These things are the only reason that this part, like, is doable. If I remove these... It's just, I don't know, it's just harder, I guess. It's just kind of a worse timing. I don't really know how to go about fixing this either. I feel like I kind of just have to let this UFO timing be hard. Maybe I can put, um, little, little like, markers. Yeah, that could work. Um, let me see. Oh my god, dude. I did not realize that uh, they're going above the player. The, the hitboxes showed that there was still something back there. What? Hitboxes are lying to me? No, there is something there. What? What the... These are on group layer one for some reason. Why? Alright, I feel good about this one. Yes, huge. Honestly, I don't think there's a whole lot more that I need to fix. I mean, eh, you know, the level could use a touch-up in uh, the decoration department. But the level itself, I actually think is not too bad, not too bad. So I guess we're moving on. Oh, the sink layout. This is one of my most popular videos, and I'm like very thankful for that. But 
this is just like not a very good level and honestly it probably needs its own entire video which is what it's gonna get yep yep uh, I'm going to be remaking the sync layout in its own video and I'll be releasing it all <laughs> Kind of a while from now, I'm gonna do it on the four year anniversary of that video coming out. Just wanted to let you guys know, I'm gonna do this in its own video. So we're gonna move on from that. Final level is the original race. This is a, like a 1.0-esque kind of level that I made a really long time ago. I, I really do like it, I think it's actually pretty decent, but there are some parts in it that just have strange gameplay. I think it's unique but that doesn't mean that it's good. Like this part, like there's no warning for which ones are gonna come off. Like th this, that previous segment and this part are like both kind of questionable gameplay. Um, did I miss the speed change? The gameplay gets much worse from this point on. Like here, what is this? <laughs> I hear like the, the coin route is like the normal looking route and the, the not coin route you have to take like a secret path for. And then there's this part, which I don't even know what happened here. So that's something. Um, is it, again, this is like sort of just kind of like, it's sort of just kind of like a mid-level. I, I just think that it could definitely be better. So, so... <laughs> One thing um, that I do want to change that, again, I don't think it's bad, I think it's just sort of useless, is like... Why does the robot portal move? Let's just put it here. Then we have this part. So let's see if we can telegraph which one is going to go. Oh, I know what we can do! Yeah, that works. That's cool. <clears throat> so it'll turn red before um, launching. Oh, nope, nope, nope. We don't want 10 and 9 to, to do that. Oh, yeah, look at that. You can definitely... T yeah, like, oh, this one's gonna go. Oh, that one's gonna go. Oh, that one too. Oh! -hoo -hoo. All right. This part, I think, is pretty good. It's got an interesting gimmick. I don't know why this doesn't go all the way down. Man, I, I like really like this, this like <laughs> blocky wave thing. Who, and look at this man, this little man that appears on your screen for half a second. Um, we're gonna keep him the same. Let's give him cat ears though. Let's make him a cat. Yes, he's a cat. Kind of a malformed cat. Perfect, he's so beautiful. Kind of misshapen, but Beautiful nonetheless. Okay, the gameplay in this part I know for a fact is kind of weird. So let's see what we got to work with here. That's a little bit of a weird uh, transition. Man, what was I thinking when I made this? You know, I think what would be better here is if we just... What is happening? Yeah, I guess it makes sense that the cube is probably a bit wider than one block. There we go. It doesn't too late, though. Okay, and then we're going to make this just a regular portal. Or even better yet, instead of doing that, we can just put some D blocks on here. I, I still think this gameplay is a bit questionable, but... I mean, it's... At, at least it's, like, readable. It's just not very... It's just kind of annoying and boring, but... I don't care. So many questionable decisions that I don't think I'll ever be able to fully understand. We're just gonna generally make this part better. More... I mean, not so much more readable, but just easier. And then, like, I don't even know what's going on here. Why don't we just put, like, a black orb or something? I, I don't know. Okay. Delete. There we go. Like, this is something entirely different and better. Um, same thing with this part. Just uh, select all that, and then we're gonna delete, and beautiful. Alright, so now we've made this, which, again, I think is marginally better. Uh... All right, I think this is better. Um, I don't... 
Don't even want to talk about whatever's going on here. Um, this coin is kind of hard and not very good, but I'm going to leave it just because it's a coin, so it should be harder. I mean, I was going to see if I could maybe make this part a little bit easier, um, but I don't think it'll make a huge difference in general. Yeah, because like the problem is like these gaps are kind of annoyingly spaced. Yeah, okay, we can move this bottom one down. So we've got that, and then we have this part. Which honestly, I like a lot. I'm really happy with the quote unquote decoration I did. And I think this blue orb thing at the end is kind of clever where you've got a hold out of one of them. So I think we're done here. Um, I'm gonna try and play from the start and see if I can do it. I'll do it in practice. But I wanna try and get through it in one go if I can. So we made this part a little bit easier. We made this part more readable. Uh, no change here. Um, oh wait, what? Oh, why are there invisible, <coughs> why are there invisible, invisible blocks? What? Huh? Why? Oh my god, don't ever let me touch the editor again, dude. Maybe we should just restructure this thing entirely. All right, again, here we go. All right. What? Why does that happen? I'm so confused. Huh. Okay, that's a little bit jank, but I think that it works. You know what, I'm such an idiot. Why don't I just do like this to align the two of them? Like this will shoot them down way faster. And why are these portals the wrong way? What is wrong with me? Like, what was I cooking in like 2017, dude? Oh my god. You, you must be joking. There's something off about this. Why are these like not symmetric? Wait, oh my god, the border only goes up to this point? Oh, so the map literally is not symmetric at the start. Oh, Jesus, okay, finally. From this point, let's go, come on. You're kidding. You're kidding! Dude, why? Why does this not work consistently? This is so stupid. What is this? What even is this part? Wait, that's really all I had to do? Oh my god. This game sucks. Hate Geometry Dash. <clears throat> From the UFO. Okay, so we made that part a bit easier. We made this a cat. Uh, we made some changes here. All right. Pretty good, that opens up now. This actually works, like, at all. Didn't really, well, we changed up the spikes here. We made these platforms free. Uh, I die because I suck. We made this part, this part a bit, a bit, we made it a little bit easier. Uh, we made this part not awful. Oh God, I saw invisible pink orbs there that I forgot to remove. <laughs> Uh, we didn't change too much here, just a bit easier. Made that part a little bit easier as well. And I don't think we changed anything here. So that is our fixed level. Yeah, That's what I'm saying though, like I really like this level. It just had so many weird like buggy parts that was just like, it was just like, why? Like, why is this, why is it this way? But yeah, I'm actually pretty satisfied with all the changes we made. So yeah, uh, thank you guys very much for watching. I don't know if I'm gonna upload these cause they're just already, they're, they're just modified versions of levels that are already on my account. And those levels don't really get much traction anyways cause they're really old. But I guess if you want me to upload them, I will. So yeah, thank you guys very much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.